uh, produce mom's here. She's been she's here early and she's been busy. It smells yeah. good already. And it looks like you're not doing anything super complicated, but I'm not. It no, great. you know, just just don't want to mess up on any style. Well. So yeah, yeah, I do all the never time. <laughs> what are you right. doing here? So we have a dish, um, celery gratin. It's from okay. Josie's Organics. We actually had their kale on, so mm -hmm. this is one of their holiday oh, recipes. Nice. Love it. Um, it's really just an indulgent way to enjoy kind of an ordinary vegetable. You know, it really makes it extraordinary and and unlike. Any presentation I've ever had, you know, yeah. I've, I've never had celery be the star of the side dish. You know, never. it's always just been something that's diced in. One it's always thing, been something you put something else on. It's, like some it's yeah, a vehicle. Yeah, celery. You smear yeah. peanut butter, some cream cheese, you know, stuff so like that. So this is really easy to make. So you you start with obviously your your washed celery ribs. Right. Always wash okay. it. Now here's the here's the step that a lot of home cooks won't do, but okay. it really makes a huge difference. You just run your vegetable peeler over it and get rid of the stringy ribs oh. on the celery okay so okay. I have done that to all of these here so these are these are peeled and cut into like three to four inch pieces toss them into your saute pan in this saute pan I have I have a little bit of olive oil and butter mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I also have red onion and a little bit of garlic that I just added okay. so you let these saute down Smells crazy and it's going to, to take, so yeah, and this step will take about 15 minutes. Okay. Okay? So these saute down. After 15 minutes have passed, ooh, ooh. actually, you should uh, put your, see, I told you I'm going to mess up. No, you're not. Put, your, uh, put your chicken stock, and then they simmer with the chicken stock for okay. 15 minutes, okay? So the total is going to be a half hour? No, 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 no. Oh, well, no, she's back. No, she's taking back to earlier. She's All right. Oh. Celery. Here with chicken stock. Add the chicken stock. Saute 15, 15 minutes. minutes. There you okay. go. Got it. Yes. I will, right. I will call you when Let I make this, this hang at home out. so you can walk me through it. That's right. So okay, clearly. so then after this has sautéed for six, for 15 minutes, you will know it's ready when your knife can easily go through the celery. The okay. celery is okay. gotcha. tender. And then you put it into your casserole pan. We're all communicating so well this morning. Ah. The second it shows. <laughs> All right, and then you add, it's a gratin, so you have to add some cream. You, you have to. You do. And then this is shredded Gruyere, about a cup. Is it typically, it's, it's a stronger white cheese? It or? is. It, it's got kind of a natural nutty flavor. It melts okay. really well. Oh, there so, you go. That's good. Yeah, but okay. if you don't have Gruyere, you're not interested in it, you can use like Monterey Jack or whatever. Sure. Okay, pop it in the oven. It'll go in there for sure. about... 30 minutes at 400 okay. degrees. Boom. Close it up. Yep. And this Set is it. what you're left with. Now, a reason I love this dish, too, for it's Thanksgiving, mm -hmm. you can do everything up to popping it in the oven. So you can assemble it, oh, cover it, nice. put and it then, in the, yes. Oh, that's great. That's, that's what I did last night. That's, with this. that's yeah. highly coveted real estate on Thanksgiving. Oh, oh man. Oh Absolutely. It's, it's, so yeah. you can prep everything in advance and then pop that in the oven right before you're ready to serve it. 30 minutes, 400 degrees, and this is what it will look like nice. Well, and let's be honest, there's going to be awesome. plenty of other heavy dish options. So if you're eliminating, no, nothing against potatoes. Love potatoes. No, no, they're great. But on yeah. Thanksgiving, I mean, it's one of 20 things. So if you're going to have your yams or whatever, why not make a lighter version? You're still getting your cheese, right? Yeah, that's right. It's, great it's a really substitute. great dish. So uh, we'll have to have you guys sample it, too. Uh, yeah. Now, this is a uh, this is something for kids. These are just little for kids at heart? celery. Yes. They look like celery. <laughs> they're like cake pops. I was going to say they're like trees from the Lorax. They are. Oh, yeah. yeah. Do, so. so these are cake pops, but they're not. Not. They're so what, 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 yeah, what, what did you what use? This here is a this refried is, greens. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> it is chocolate syrup. <laughs> That'd be the worst thing. Chocolate syrup, syrup. direction. Peanut right. butter, Can cream cheese. Let me try. Oh, oh wait. Okay. Say that again. Chocolate syrup, peanut, peanut butter, butter, cream, cream cheese. cheese. Okay. It is so good. All right, she's right. It's delicious. Really good. And then tastes nothing like beans. And then when your gratin is out of the. Once it gets out of the oven, you let it sit for about 10 minutes. Okay. And this is what it will look like. When well, you and we were it. talking before the show about Let me try it. Yeah. how wasteful Americans are, particularly when it oh comes to goodness. produce. And celery is one of those things. You buy it, you put it in the drawer, and maybe well, you don't think what to do with it because you don't. You have well, a thought about it. So many yeah. people with right. their celery, they'll cut this part off, yeah. and okay. they'll cut this part off. So essentially, they're tossing half of the celery. Mm -hmm. This dish uses 
from the very bottom, you know, from root to stalk, literally. Right. Yeah. You use the entire thing. Even these uh, leafies, mm -hmm. oh, there's good. so much flavor in these. Leafies? Include is that them. official? The, the, is that well, that's, term, that's what Rhoda's mom says. I didn't know if that's the... Leafies. And you leafies. can garnish, leafies. just like what you would garnish with microgreens, mm -hmm. sure. garnish with your celery leaves, add some of the... Uh, the hearts, this part, dice that all the way down. Okay. okay. Do not waste that. Don't right. waste it. This That's is right. delicious. Isn't That's it awesome? Delicious. Yes, it is. I could yeah. uh, eat that as a meal. What also. are we going to do with the next one? It's really segment? good. Cauliflower mashed potatoes. Oh. As in just are there cauliflower, any mashed cauliflower mashed potatoes. Mashed potatoes. <laughs> no, but there's, there's going to be more to it than that. Cauliflower mashed potatoes, but no potatoes. That's right. Uh, no potatoes. That's right. Coming up, we're talking about some cute coats that will also keep you...